The second major car maker now Mazda just announcing a significant recall involving its tribute SUVs and this comes on the heels of yesterday's massive Ford Escape recall. The ABC 15 investigators first exposed acceleration issues in both SUVs and investigator Joe Ducey here this morning with us with the latest on this new development a yeah. new recall a similar car here's what we're similar talking car. about. Yeah the Mazda Tribute and the Ford Escape were both at the same plan have basically the same engine so it wasn't really a big surprise today today's announcement. Mazda is recalling 270 17,000 V6 2001 to 2008 tribute tributes. It follows a series of reports by the ABC 15 investigators involving crashes linked to acceleration issues in the SUVs. Mazda and Ford are offering the same fix for the problems. Both car makers say they will lift the engine cover so that the cruise control cable can't stick and force the throttle wide open and therefore it would accelerate. It's the same problem an inspector says he found under the hood of a 2002 Ford Escape crash that killed a Payson girl earlier this year. Ford cited that accident in its recall notice. But now, some auto safety experts say both car makers are making the wrong fix. They're not fixing the underlying defect, which is the cruise control cable. Clarence Ditlow is with the Center for Auto Safety in Washington, and he's pushing the government to find Ford for not issuing the recall years ago. Now, government regulators are investigating the cable and throttle issues and say they will continue investigating despite the recalls. And remember, if you can't stop an accelerating car, put it in neutral. And if you have one of these Fords or Mazdas, take it to your dealer immediately. Also go to abc15.com slash investigators for more safety details and to see all the stories we've done. But I think that's the key for people to know about the putting it in neutral. And the yeah. more people hear yeah. that, the more it's going to click in those panic situations. It's been a big top of a conversation of people saying, what happens if this happens to me? And it could in any car just because of some other problem. Exactly. There, there have been a lot of acceleration issues in a lot of cars. So. Should people out there wait for letters to come in the mail from Ford, from no. Boston? No, not at this time. They should go to the dealers okay. and they should have this uh, temporary fix. Maybe the cable will be disconnected mm -hmm. until they get the letter where the recall can actually be done. All right. Important stuff, Joe. We appreciate you breaking this down and continuing to follow this for us. Yeah. Thanks. Thanks.